Okay guys, now I'll show you uh, installing it onto the wall. But before I do so, I'd like to show you the back end of the inverter. As you can see, it's a very extremely well thought out design. It's got integrated fins and handlebars for single man installation. Even though it's a hybrid, it's a little bit heavier than a grid connector, it's still able to be carried by one person. So now, as you can see on the wall, you get the mounting plate ready and you can simply just put it on the wall. And you've got these integrated handlebars. And you can secure it by two M4 screws on the sides. And it's ready to go. So then now let's plug in the terminals. All we need to do is plug everything in. So we'll plug in the PV in here. Uh, we don't have a battery, but if you have a battery, it plugs into the battery connections. Plug in the Wi Fi dongle. Plugs in nice and easy. Communication port. Everything plugs in there. And finally, the AC plug. You obviously the backup, this is the blue grid connection and that plugs in there. All we need to do now is power it up and then com commission it with the phone. Now when you power the system up at first, this green LED will very slowly pulse. Uh, it'll go solid once you've got the system commissioned. There's some LEDs in the dongle you need to know about as well. The blue one on the left is the power LED, so if that's on you know it's powered up. The green one in the middle is a communication one. It's flashing because it's searching for a Wi-Fi signal. We will connect to that shortly and it will go steady green. Once you're connected to the iSolar Glout, the yellow net light will light up and you'll know you're connected to iSolar Cloud.